If you're watching this video, you're more than likely a college student who's looking for a job and interested in Uber or someone who's just interested in Uber overall. So now I want you to keep something in mind as you watch this video. The average American, based on Google, makes about $32,000 per year. Just keep that in mind. Now keep watching because surely I'm gonna reveal to you how much I made in an entire year and then I'm gonna break it down into how much that was per week, two of my most profitable weeks while still being in college, doing all my homework, getting together with my friends to, to study for exams, on my senior year, one of the hardest years for an engineering student and still making pretty good money doing Uber. Now as a disclaimer, most of the numbers that I'm talking about in this video are pre-tax numbers. Okay, so now I have it right here. So I made about $40,600 in one year. That's about $3,380 per month in average. Now the crazy part is I didn't work every week. I didn't work every day. I didn't have a rigid schedule. Instead of working 40 hours a week like the regular person does, like I do now, I only worked about 30 hours, like actual work. Now if you count the time that it takes you to get to the point where you're gonna start working or the time it takes you to come back home where you're done with with your rides or maybe sometime while you're still waiting for a ride. I worked about 35 hours a week uh, in total, but in reality, actual work, 30 hours. If you do the math, I was averaging about $25 an hour. Now I wanna give you a secret before I jump into the next part. If you do this job part-time, you can make a lot more money. Let me explain why. Because if you do it part-time, you're only gonna work on peak time hours where you're making the most. Or let's say when Uber is saying something like, we're gonna give you 200 bucks if you do 15 rides. You just do your 15 rides and then you're done, right? So you make the most when you work less, when you know people are tipping the most or at certain times of the day, you make a lot more per hour. And I'm talking about 50 an hour, 60 an hour. I've done that before. But if once you start working full time, it's like you make all this money here, but then slowly the rest of the day, you're gonna start making less, 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 and it evens it out to a lesser average per hour which is 25 in my case. So I just want you to keep that in mind. You could actually make a lot more. My dog just made a whole mess there. All right, so why Uber for students, right? I'm gonna talk about some of the benefits based on my own experience. Flexibility is a big one, right? You don't have to work every day. You don't have to work from nine to five. You can work whenever you want. I'll give you some examples. For example, I used to go to school about 45 minutes to an hour from my house. Sometimes after school, after my classes were done, I would get on Uber and I would either start working in the area or I would put a filter because you can. Let's say in simple terms, I was going to tell the app, hey, look, I'm going this way. Give me rides that are only going that way. So in essence, it'll take you a little bit longer to get to your house, but you will pick up rides on your way home. So you're getting paid to go back home. You're getting paid for your gas and everything. Start working now and maybe work a little bit in the morning, then go to school. Then let's say you have two hours uh, break Maybe you do homework or maybe you do a couple rides and then when you're done with school, you can do work, you come back home, you study for something and then you go back out there in and out whenever you want. It's the flexibility is through the roof and you do not have a boss, which is great. You don't have to ask anybody for time off, uh, vacation time, whatever you do work whenever you want. You don't have a boss asking you like, how's everything going, this and that. It's beautiful. Another beautiful benefit, so you could literally take out the money that you made after the ride is done and you put it in your bank account. So this is what I used to do, right? I wanna tell you the secret right here. If I wanted to buy myself something expensive, I'd be like, you know what, that's fine, I can do it because let me just make that money today and I'll put it in my bank and boom, I had money already. You know, let's say I wanna buy myself new shoes. Oh my God, I don't have 70 bucks. Well, I'm only buying myself shoes if I make it doing Ubers. Instead of like using the money I already had, I would be like, I make more, so I can buy this. One of the huge benefits, for me at least, I got to know my CD way better. I was able to drive after doing it for four years without the GPS. So people get impressed because like, I know exactly where I'm going. I know all the roads, I know names, I know directions, all the streets. You know streets by name, you know houses. Like you, you know, it, it gives you very much a sense of location. Now I wanna mention something, right? This video is how much I made in one year, but I know there's a topic that needs to be talked about, which is the taxes, right? And people be like, I don't know how to do the taxes. It's super simple, guys. I think I read online on Google that right now in 2022, you can deduct 58 cents per mile that you drive to how much you made in profits. Uh, for your taxes. And it's really a simple process. There's nothing really uh, complex about it. They give you the one form 
that you give to your tax person or you can use TurboTax, whatever you use. There's no headaches. It's extremely simple. So this is the end of the video guys. Leave a comment down below though, if you want me to expand on something or if you have new questions about it, if you're curious about a specific topic, safety, all that type of stuff. I know there's a million questions I had when I started doing Uber and I didn't have anybody to tell me. You can either leave a comment down below with your question and if I see that is something that a lot of people would wanna know about, I'll make a video on it or you can follow me on Instagram and just send me a DM. Uh, my Instagram is public, so you can just go in, see my dog and send me a DM with any questions you may have. So thank you very much for watching this video. I hope it was something helpful for you. And yeah, definitely consider doing Uber as a college student because it's a great job. You guys have a blessed day. Take care.